get this on there. Make sure y'all get this on there, man. Let me sit up straight. Everything, arms, legs, core, you know what I'm saying? Just a little post-game post -game party uh, for BK. Post-game dub party, yeah, that sounds so much better. <laughs> Tyrese, what did you really think of Joe Powell's performance tonight? At this point, I mean, what are you, 40? Yeah, I mean, I'm not even surprised at this point. It's just, you know, he's he's phenomenal. And, you know, you don't take – I try extremely hard not to take it for granted. Um, you know, it's because we see it consistently every single night, you know, his greatness. Um, I don't want to take it for granted. I want to be able to, you know, down the road, down long, long time ago, I mean, from now, be able to tell people that, you know, I was able to be a part of something very extremely special. And – you know, he's, he's, he's amazing. The way Joel is playing, and then obviously James is going to be here soon, just like how deadly of that duo do you think that could be just because of what they both can do? Yeah, you know, it's going to be great. And uh, I think I said that before, and it's, um, you know, we're going to get in right away, get to work, and, uh, you know, Coach Doc keeps saying we don't have much time. And, uh, you know, the shoot rounds and the practices that we have, we're going to try to get the continuity, you know, really well and go out here and try to do something special. As a point guard, you know how important it is to view the deep, read the defense and kind of see the floor and the vision. Just when you watch Joel kind of do the, the same thing and directing traffic and all that, just what's that like for you when you're on the floor with him and he's also able to facilitate the way that he does? Yeah, I mean, it's great. You know, he studies the game. He loves the game of basketball. Like, as soon as our game is over, he gets on his phone and he's watching three, four other games. So, um, you know, that, being, him being a student of the game, as great as he is, is just really well. It's really good. It's going really well for him, and uh, you know I'm proud of him. I just I just hope he gets to the the ground safely sometimes when he's maneuvering, and it's a it's a joy to watch. What was your uh, initial response to that dunk? To his dunk? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> you just trying to flex something. Oh, y'all seen that? Yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah. I wasn't intentional, but that's that's exactly what I did. I was in the back court. Like, Joel's, Joel's different. Yeah, did you ever, like, imagine that you would meet, like, kind of follow up on what she did, but, like, this guy is so big, and he's able to do all those things. It's like it's like a video game sometimes. Yeah, it's, I mean, I, I'm, I'm at a loss of words now. It's just, like, some stuff he does, and the way he gets the rebound and drill with the core, he did, like, a little fake pass, uh, like a little CP3 fake pass I saw today. And it's just like, it's just amazing to see it. It's amazing to see it. And I, like I said, I'm just glad to be a part of it. And uh, I try not to take any of it for granted. Besides his performance, just what do you feel like allowed you guys to, to create the distance tonight and, and to kind of pull away from them in the fourth quarter? Stops. Stops. We had, you know, we went down, I think, in the third quarter, down by like, I don't know, one or three. And uh, we had a timeout, and uh, Coach Danberg and Coach Doc said, if we get stops, we'll be fine. If we get stops, if we're getting good looks, we're just not make, knock them down right uh, at that moment. But uh, we started to get stops, got a lot of, you know, transition layups, and they started scoring. Joel hit a couple of big shots. And, uh, you know, once you get stops, it, it demoralizes teams. Uh, once they can't score, it's extremely hard. You don't want to play defense anymore once you're not scoring. So, uh, you know, that, that's one of our main goals every single night, get consecutive stops in a row, and, uh, you know, that really helps us. Speaking of stops, you said six steals tonight, and that's his career high. What makes him so special? He just he, he just seems to always be in the right place at the right time. And uh, I was we were talking in the locker room before before the game today. I was like, like I wonder what the defense thinks like when they're they're coming off and they see their man, you know, their teammate open, and he just jumps the passing lane. It's like. It's, if I was on another team, I would just go to his side and he's like, no, I'm not going over there. He's just going to take the ball. So, um, but it's just amazing. Like, he's another, you know, player that I just try not to take for, uh, to, for granted because, um, you know, what he's doing is special.